Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And it looked like the wind was blowing my coat open. My mom never did like that picture much. All right, 7 o'clock, 55 degrees. We'll be looking for some scattered showers and thunderstorms out there. Uh, well, the thunder chance pretty minimal, mostly showers, but we can't rule out a little thunder and lightning. Our Storm Team 2 app, if you had it. Uh, Logan County earlier reporting a lightning strike within about four miles. And uh, 9 o'clock down to 50 degrees with some showers. And then 47 at 11 p.m. We'll start to get back mostly clear skies later in the evening as those temperatures drop. Off. 40 degrees at 8 o'clock, sunny skies, mostly sunny at noon, 53, and then 59 at 5 p.m. with partly sunny skies expected. The evening showers passing through again, a low risk of thunder and clearing skies later tonight with some frost in our weather headlines. As a matter of fact, about half the Miami Valley under a frost advisory, but even if you're up in Mercer uh, County, also Miami, uh, Green, Clark counties, you may see some frost, even some of those northeast counties. We can't rule it out just to function if the wind drops off enough tonight, but if you're in a protected area from the wind, a little better chance of some of that frost formation. Lots of sunshine Saturday, a bit on the cool side. Mother's Day going to be wet and cool and a frost chance. Can you believe it? Another one coming up for the month of May. That could be around Tuesday morning. We're tracking the rain tonight on live Doppler 2 HD and right now Dark County Greenville seeing the rain down to Arcanum right along 127 southward there toward Eaton. We've just had some heavier showers pass through and that rain into Butler County and more rain back to the west in eastern Indiana near Muncie and also southwest of Richmond all moving east but you can see once you get west of Indianapolis uh, the rain really starting to cut off now so getting back to some dry weather and some clearing skies and that should build into the area later this evening as this cold front passes across the region then high pressure builds in tomorrow uh, to bring us the quiet weather pattern low temperatures tonight mid 30s cold enough for the potential for some of that frost with the clearing skies could even be around 34 Salina and Greenville, Urbana, and Springfield, 35 Troy, Piqua, Sydney, and then high temperatures tomorrow expected to make it into the mid to upper 50s over the northern Miami Valley with readings down south in the upper 50s to near 60 degrees. But Sunday, a big temperature spread, some low 60s south, upper 40s north. One of those days where it will be about 15 degrees on the spread from the north to south across the Miami Valley with a warm front moving north. Showers threatening the area as we speak. We've seen those move through on and off through the afternoon on the Goodwill Auto Auction camera. And right now in Dayton, 50 seven with a northwest wind at nine miles per hour. Jeff Cador and Bell Center only 53 degrees. David Wessler, New Paris 55. We've seen some reports of about a quarter at about four tenths of an inch. Still around 60 Barbara Richards and Kettering and the future track forecast brings that rain through and then clearing skies later tonight. Uh, after some evening showers, look for the potential for late night scattered frost. Low temperature 35. Tomorrow, a lot of sunshine, partly to mostly sunny, up around 60 for that afternoon high. We'll see temperatures start in the 30s in the morning, near 60 at 3 p.m., with a few more clouds around later in the day. And on Sunday, rain likely for Mother's Day, 56. Dry conditions return Monday, 60, another chance of frost Tuesday morning, and then mid-60s Wednesday and Thursday, upper 60s Friday, maybe next weekend we'll throw in some 70s.